Welcome everybody, Ryan Munson here, author of The 40 Inch Diet. Uh, I want to make an extra video today since uh, we didn't get to do everything in the grocery store last time. Uh, I went to the grocery store again this morning. Unfortunately, uh, we kind of got kicked out with the video camera. They didn't like me filming and talking as I was going through. So now that I'm home and I have everything unloaded, I'm going to show you what I got. All right, so we're going to check out the refrigerator. I uh, picked up my sprouted grain Ezekiel bread. Uh, I got some Powerade Zeros in here. I do like to drink something besides water every once in a while, but I don't like the calories. Um, I got my pre-cooked sweet potatoes in there. The organic beef was on sale this morning. So I got two packages of that. I got some canned pumpkin in here. Uh, I'll give you guys some recipes on that later on. Got my chicken. Um, there's a uh, whole Cornish game hen that I'm going to roast. This is my pot that I keep my hard boiled eggs in and it is empty. There's one, two little guys in there so I've got to get to work, hard boil some eggs. Got some Greek yogurt. Uh, that's probably the only dairy food that I actually do consume. Uh, there's all my eggs, cage free of course. Water. What else we got in here? Today I picked up uh, some cranberry juice concentrate and some lemon juice. Um, I posted a link a couple days ago on uh, Facebook and Twitter talking about some liver detox uh, protocols. I'm going to start doing that. Uh, if you guys have any questions on that, let me know and uh, I can go into a little bit more detail on that. Um, I do use butter occasionally. This is pasture-fed butter uh, from a grain, gra or, I'm sorry, grass-fed and grass-finished cow. Uh, let's see what else did we pick up today here's my freezer frozen broccoli more frozen broccoli got some ground flax seeds frozen mixed berries frozen cherries blueberries more mixed berries there's a packet of chicken and some frozen broccoli lots of uh, chicken broccoli berries I uh, got some more sweet potatoes there's bananas there's my almond butter, turnip, natural peanut butter, olive oil. There's my raw organic coconut oil. And I also picked up some raw apple cider vinegar this morning. And I'm going to post a special video for you guys talking about that uh, apple cider vinegar here in a little while. Uh, a very interesting product there with a lot of benefits. And I forgot to show you my fruits and vegetable drawers. I uh, picked up some celery. Uh, celery is something that you should always get organic. It's one of the most sprayed and uh, pesticide contaminated foods out there. So always make sure you're getting the organic celery if you have uh, access to it. We got some kale, some spinach, uh, there's a red onion. And in the fruits over here, I got some organic wax free apples. Um, oranges, there's some grapefruits in there also. Um, and just taking one final look, I think that's about everything. Um, I do have, in this drawer I have some packets of guacamole and uh, this is nothing more than uh, avocado and uh, a few other minimal ingredients. Uh, that's probably as close to a processed food as you'll ever see me eating but uh, if we read the ingredients it is avocado, jalapenos, onions, garlic, lime juice and salt so nothing uh, there's no chemicals no preservatives or anything in there so uh, we're still sticking to our no processed foods and uh, the last little thing is my asparagus I uh, just brought that home and it was wet so I'm leaving it out to dry so it doesn't get soggy and rot Alright guys, you've seen my refrigerator and uh, you've seen me go grocery shopping a couple times, so it's time for you to go out and do the same thing.